Hey guys, welcome back to another salsa tutorial. Today we are going to focus on a basic salsa combo. I'm gonna have Paul show it to you with music first and then he'll break it down. What's up everybody, Paul Kermirin here with another salsa tutorial. Today we're going to be learning just a basic salsa combination that involves all of the basic steps that you've already learned. You could do this at a party, if you're alone, you don't have a partner, uh, girls could do it, guys could do it, everyone could do it. So let's get started. You're going to start with your right leg going back and then you're going to step forward with your uh, left leg, just like a basic salsa step. So you're going to go one, two, three. Now you're gonna step forward with your left leg and you're gonna do a turn over your right shoulder. So you're gonna go step, you're gonna turn, and you're gonna step, all right? Facing back to the front, so it's a three-step turn. So we did right leg going back in a basic. As you're doing this, you wanna really incorporate your hips into it. Just create like a figure eight movement with your hips. So you're gonna go back to the right, forward to the left, and together. That's your first step. Now your second step, you're gonna transfer your weight to your left leg but you're not going to transfer it fully because you're going to use your back leg to pivot you and turn you to the right side. So you're going to pivot and turn to the right side, face the other side. My weight is on my right leg. Now I'm going to uh, use the rest of my momentum to collect my leg and fully face forward one more time. Just like that. And one, two, three, five, six, seven. Just like that one more time. And one, two, three, left leg forward, turn right leg step, turn left leg step. So I switch weight between my legs every single time. Just like that one more time. So we did right, left, together, left, right, left, one more time. One, two, three, five, six, seven, good. Now from here, we're gonna be doing what's called the cucaracha. So you're gonna be stepping, since you just step with your left leg, your right leg should be free. You're gonna be stepping with your right leg to the side. And you're gonna be doing right, left, together, and then left to the other side. Left, right, together. Just like that one more time. So we did right, transfer your weight to your right side, transfer your weight to the left side, and step together. And then same thing on the left side. Transfer your weight to your left, transfer your weight to your right, and step together. Now, you really wanna incorporate your hips into this too to add a little flavor. You wanna add this eight figure eight mo motion one more time. So you're gonna go to the right side, forward and around, to the left side, forward and around, and step together. And same thing on the left side. To the left side, forward and around, to the right side, forward and around, and then step together. So that's the little combination. Let's try it one more time from the top. And we have one, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. And then again from the top with your right leg. And one, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. A little bit faster. So we did right, left, right, left, turn, left, right, and side, left, and together. And one, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Now your hands, really loose, have fun with it. It shouldn't be so placed. It's really an extension of your body and your uh, leg movement. You can add like a, a one arm out or whatever it is that you feel, but really it should just be a characteristic of you rather than me telling you what to do. But if you really want something that you feel uncomfortable with your hands out to the side, you could just keep circling your arms around in a casual, um, continuous movement. So as you're stepping, whatever you're doing, it's just a circle, circle. So my arm is just going circle, 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 circle. And I'm going right, left, right, left, okay? so. From here, it's just a vibe. You really want to get low into the ground rather than being so upright. So you want to think one, two, so I'm, I'm bent and I'm in this place rather than one, two, three, five, six, seven, right? So really 
sink into the ground and have fun with it. Let's try it one more time a little bit faster. So we did one, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, uh, again. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six. Last time, one, two, three, five, six, seven. Quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow. Let's try with music. We'll start off slow and we'll speed it up as we go. Ready? Five, six, seven, and one, two, three. Left, turn, together. Side, together, side, together. Again, one, two, three. Five, six, seven. Side, and to the left. Left, and quick, quick, hold. Quick, quick, hold, side, and side. Last time, slow. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Le right, and left. Now fast. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. And one, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three. Last time, one, two, three. Five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Good.